Welcome back to TV8 and Good Morning Vale. Joining me right now from Young Colors, a fantastic young adult store, kids store that we have up here at Beaver Creek, is Donna Prescott. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? I'm doing great. I'm going to advise our viewers <laughs> right before you came to us live with your hat that you have here. A couple of birds. I believe that they actually thought it was a flower. They attacked us. I think so. Yeah, I felt the feathers <laughs> flutter across my face. So. <laughs> Maybe they'll come back. Good morning to you. Yeah. I love your shop location okay. right here at Beaver Creek, right next to uh, the covered bridge. Tell us more about the store itself. Well, it's kind of a unique experience for people who come um, to Colorado. We are a Colorado-based company, and I design all the fabrics for all the kids' clothes. Um, and and I, I love it. You come in there, it's so vibrant. I mean, the place is full of life. I have two boys myself. Um, and shopping for kids is critical because, you, especially up here in this climate, you want them to be warm, yep. but you also want them to look cool. Yeah, exactly. And so we do a lot of layers stuff, a lot of t-shirts and a lot of leggings and then dresses and a lot of versatile pieces that you can wear almost all year, which is kind of nice. Um, what, what goes into the process? Now you say you think of, you know, all the way from the materials all the way through the product. Take us through that process. So it kind of starts out with an inspiration on something and I'll, I'll see something and it'll spark an idea and that's basically where I get the fabric idea. Um, a couple years ago when we were at, well, more than that, but the Stardust Hotel in Las Vegas, we were there for a trade show and they were taking it down. And the only thing left was the big sign. And I looked at the motif on the sign and it was just so unique and different. And so that became one of my fabrics and it's actually one of our more popular fabrics. So you never know where it's going to come from, the inspiration. I love it. And so you start from that and, and with the hat, for an example, you go through materials and then you come up with the actual concept of what you're going to construct. I love these little hats. Not only is this beautiful <laughs> for the young ladies out there, but also fun. Functional. This is a very warm lid. Yep, it's a great hat. It's all cotton. It actually breathes, so it's a great thing. And then what we did was we actually put flower clips on it, and they're hair clips, so they can wear them in their hair or on the hat. So they can change them out, make them different, um, and then they're washable, which parents love because yes, they're going to fall off and get dirty or whatever. Yeah. So yeah, throw them in the wash, and you got to you know it's brand looking brand new again. So. Kids are messy. Exactly. It happens, and they play hard. Yeah. We have a few photos that we're going to bring up right now. Uh, the store itself looks fantastic, but there's so many different items you have in there. There. Yeah, we do a lot of different gift items. So I always say if I don't do it myself, then I um, will find other people who do a great job. I've been in the business for 17 years. So basically what we're bringing into the store now is spring, and that's kind of what we're showing on um, in the photos. It's uh, We have vintage whites, which is a great piece, and then we've got um, flamingos, which is our beachy resort collection. It's lots of great sundresses. For boys, we do camp shirts, which are um, Hawaiian beach inspired. We lived in Guam for three years, so I've got some of that background to pull off of. Um, you and also have the cowboy attire. Yes, exactly. We, rodeos are huge, and everywhere we go and everywhere we sell to, and so Spring Rodeo is our new spring group that we just launched, and it's already doing great in the store. And so. we have such a Western flair here, but let's face it, kids can cowboy up at any time. Exactly, and that's kind of what was funny when I first started. I didn't really do a lot of Western because I thought, well, nobody else in the country is going to want it, and then um, I started doing it, and now people, that's what they come to us for. So so I have to have Western stuff for everybody. So you should, it's, <laughs> well, you should have seen my son, you know, both my kids when they were like four years old, shorts and cowboy boots. Exactly, That's yeah. What and now what we do is we do a cowboy hat style in the crochet, which is great for boys because you can wash the cowboy hat. That's great. So. And tell us about your hours and why you do so. I wanted to bring this up and just show this. This is nice. You know, you stop by, pick up a little gift idea. You do gift wrapping. We can do the gift bag form, which we always do bags because it's easier for the kids to get in and out of as they open it. Um, and basically we're uh, 12 to 5 on Sunday and then 11 to to six and then Friday and Saturday we're 10 to 6. I love so. your shop. We do have to wrap it up. Uh, you have two other locations though. Uh, we're in Breckenridge, and we've got two stores there. One is the kids' store, and one is Cowboys and Dadies, our ladies' store. Wonderful to finally meet you. Good to meet you, too, Ken. <laughs> I've, I've interviewed her husband for several months exactly. at Young Colors, so great to see you. Yeah, and uh, stop by and see Young Colors. They're located right up here in Beaver Creek. Right now, though, we're going to take it back to the studios with Trisha Swenson. She's joined by Hillary McSpadden with Landmark Residences. Trisha, 